This video highlights some of the new and updated features of Brightspace Learning Environment 20.21.7. The new assignment creation experience now supports categories. When it is enabled, instructors can add new or existing assignment categories when creating or editing a new assignment. To enable, ensure that the d2l.tools.activities.set categories on edit or unit configuration variable is set to on. This feature implements PI item D6656. To create the category, access assignments, click edit categories, add a category, enter a name for your category, and then click create. This release adds the following new columns to Learner Usage ADS to the Data Hub. Last quiz attempt date, last SCORM completion date, last SCORM visit date. The d2l.tools.mycoursesWidget.updated sort logic configuration variable has now reached end of life status and no longer appears in the config variable browser. With this change, the My Courses widget now uses only the updated sort logic setting by default. To reduce redundancy in the quizzes tool, the introduction field has been removed. When an instructor edits a quiz, the introduction field is no longer available. If any quiz previously had text in the introduction field, on clicking edit, the text is automatically appended to the description field. The report setup tab on the edit quiz page is now available on the context menu of a quiz and reads as setup reports. Note, you must have the manage quiz reports permission enabled for the instructor role. When setting an enforced time limit for a quiz, instructors can now set the grace period for a quiz to zero minutes in place of the default grace period setting of five minutes. This feature implements PI item D516. For quizzes that contain questions that need to be manually scored, such as written response questions, and that have the allow attempt to be set as graded immediately upon completion option disabled, a new pending evaluation status appears beside the quiz attempt on the grade quiz page. The can edit config variable values permission under roles and permissions config variable browser now reads as can see and edit config variable values. Also note that a select all checkbox has been added to the edit permissions page to enable you to select or deselect the permissions in an entire row. This feature implements PI items D6258, D253, and D2080. The d12.tools.rubrics.createExperience opt-in configuration variable is now set to on for all clients and can no longer be changed to opt out of the new experience. 